Hey everyone, Daniel here from the People Systems Store. And now I've seen a lot of surveillance equipment, and this one is not that much standing out of the crowd, but its main features are a high durability, low price, and well, affordability and the availability due to that. Today we're going to overview this fresh Dahua Intercom Monitor and the outdoor station or a call panel and after what we are going to reveal and guide you through a quick and easy activation and setup process by the Dawa software. Breaking in. Subscribe to People Systems YouTube channel and get your special offer on every deal. Well, the indoor station is an IP network equipment and it has a PoE feature that I love for the simplicity of a transmitting a power in the internet. But well, the monitor we have itself is not PoE type, so make sure to have the connectors like I do, LEA cables uh, in a quantity of two PoE switch and 20 volts power supply and well probably a knife to strip a contact wires plus maybe a screwdriver maybe for this thing for this context and now let's open the box let's see what's inside of this thing yeah all right no no it's this we're here about this thing up and well it's plastic it's glass but yet I like the design and as I said before it's simple as hell as it can be uh, guide, a quick start guide, a few duple screws, and well, of course, the contact unit. What else do we have? Well, the last piece of this, this is a, uh, the mounting stencil. Oh, oh, the bracket. Yeah, of course, the wall mounting bracket. Yeah, we're good about this one. The next thing we need is here. So, the outdoor station, that was outdoor station, man. What do we have here? Uh, of course, the guide, duples, screws, quick start guide, mounting kit, the holding, the wall holding bracket, uh, consisting of the two pieces, and the indoor station, the intercom itself, with a temper alarm in here and a screwdriver. What an awesome guys this that was. Now, let's get to the main part. DHI-VO2101E-P call panel. What's really necessary for this class of things? The protection rate, of course. That allows the device to stand against any weather and against a direct hit or any harmful actions. So the IP65 and IK10 here means you're good to go with this in any environment, regardless of how criminal or military surrounded your neighborhood is. So. The IP65 here is a dust and a slight rain resistance, and the IK10 is a great vandal proof indicator. 2 megapixel camera module, uh, 45 degree view angle, infrared sensor, and due to that, a night vision to an audio made of aluminum and, and zinc alloy has a anti tamper alarm on body and alarm input in body. The next in line is a DHI VDH2421FB intercom monitor. And I mean, you know what it is about. 7 inch 1024 by 600 touch screen, alarm sensors integrations on here, surveillance and IP cameras integration, and a two way audio allowing us to receive calls from the outside installed equipment straight to this monitor. And the Linux OS as a system on board, customized by Dahua. And I'm gonna quickly run through the interface for you right now. And so, as I mentioned before, we have here a Dawa modified Linux OS. And the first thing the device creates us with, well, the initialization screen. Right. And actually, I get a, get a note that there's no even a single button on the whole device body. So, after you input and plug the power transmission, power supply, you are ready to go and it will turn on automatically and everything. Uh, every and uh, all the configure all the setup happens while the touch screen only and your fingers of course so the password well uh this is the admin password mine will be a six eight i believe it was six all right yeah and of course the email the email you 
seat right now. Oh, God. <laughs> it's, oh, come on. It's our own email and you can always mail and you can always mail us with well just just to say hi come on right it requires a concentration and a lot of it but anyway this email means here you can always mail us say us hi to our team or I don't know, describe any of the problem, any of the issue you have, and you will always get an answer. Thumbs up for that. All right, and okay. So it was successful. It seems that I have a, I had a call. That's interesting. Oh, a call back in 1970. Wow, right, a call from the past. Uh, the OS, let's see what we got here. Of course, the call, here you're gonna see all the calls, the contact list and your contact book. And of course, well, you can always call somebody. Uh, the back, the monitor. Here you can view your door stations, the cameras, and my favorite list. Oh, I, I cannot access it as, uh, oh no, I can, I can. All right. all right, I just don't like this touch screen. Hey, come on, SOS. Of course, you can trigger uh, who to call, when to call by pressing this button. The info, oh, network abnormal, call failure. Well, actually, it's not about network because I, have, I get nothing here installed. Well, yeah, so the system uh, alarms, security alarms, publish info. And well, you got this, all the notifications the systems will give you time to time. And of course, the settings. Remember, uh, oh, oh. I don't actually remember. I think the that was yes. So remember, we have put the password of the uh, six eight. Yeah. So there is a two passwords for this device: the admin passwords, uh, the admin main view. So to access that thing, you gotta push and hold the setting button. And a menu will appear right after about I mean, seven, eight seconds. And here you can see the six. We got it. And OK. And here we enter the admin menu where we can configure the network settings, connect a VDH, uh, the SIP server, connect a VDO, of course, here. Search for devices within our subnet because we're connected through the LEN cable already. And well, of course, default the device and we'll reset. So mail, yeah, you can see it. <laughs> it's, 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 it's tried to hide it. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> right. Okay. 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 And of course, um, the standard settings is Dahua standard password. One, two, six. You've seen it right now on the screen. And okay. And here we can, oh, pick. Pick a call type. Yeah, PDA, ring setup, alarm ring setup, the ND, alarms, well, alarms, the modes. And here, what's interesting about this thing, we have a multiple areas and we can set a different modes to this thing. And this is amazing because here how it's used. You see, there's a one more button in here with a time on it. You just press here. And then you set any mode that you want that you can pre-configured before right in here after you input this password in right in here. Uh, the call forwarding, general, and uh, product info. And we're pretty much good. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. I'll make it a bit. Oh, about the time. Now let's connect this thing do this thing and show you how does this works when tied up and now as I just show you all the 
all the configuration now is the time and the part to integrate this to tie this up with this one and also activate this one as we have already activated this one well you remember that uh, six eight now we're gonna go to this one and this thing is being activated through the download software any specific software but i mean i left the official download links for you in the description so i mean you're there and also this is a poe type thing so you just gotta get one alien cable and then connect it to the poe switch and then connect it to here and you also gotta initialize this thing now we are initializing this through the uh Dahua software on a pc and here's our pc uh the thing that we need is a Dahua's toolbox in here and a specific tool in it the it's named the vdp config so you just press this button install here and open it up well i got it installed yeah of course oh because i was preparing for this one <laughs> And as you can see, within our subnet, we got a two devices, the VDH, which is a video monitor, and the video, which is a outdoor station. The VDH is initialized, and I've showed you, and also the video is not. What we do, we mark, we check, we check here, and press the initialize. Yes, check again. Admin, well, better not change it, and the password, you can create wherever the one you want. I'm turning this off right now because I don't need this and initializing this the thing. So device has been activated, completed. Refreshing a bit. And oh yeah, oh yeah. And we are really mostly done. Now what we need to go to the video uh, monitor exactly and add the device in there and now the monitor right so we gotta uh to enter the admin settings because we can add the new devices only if they enter the admin settings uh press and hold on the settings sensor button for like seven eight seconds kind of that the password it was six eight in my case it can be anything in your case but anyways what we do now we go into the search device where we can find our devices and there we have already our uh, call panel or the outdoor station whatever we make a name let it be a v t o oh come on <laughs> video one in my case i mean let it be and username admin that's the thing you gotta do remember when we were uh, activating the device we were creating the password so now you're gonna type in the password that you were using to activate the device uh, in my case that is a people 2018 and i was really precise and okay and it was set successfully now we'll do next video config you can see it's updated with the name we've set and the password we've set and of course we press uh, we, I mean, kind of a slide here. Now the status is on home screen, monitor, and now we can view. Yeah! Hey, my guys, I believe you can see it. Hey, how are you doing, guys? And this is how it happens. Now let's get to the final part. And so I can describe this as a solid and affordable equipment. Well, you know, you have here like everything that you need with a zero excesses. <laughs> it is simple to install, simple to connect, simple to use with this one, of course, will probably work for a lot of time. I got nothing else to say, except that you can get this in a people system store within a special offer. If you will just specify that you came from Daniel as you order goods from us. Thank you for watching. Subscribe and comment and your safety is our main goal in the people systems.